Okay, I'm going to show you how to make an encrypted .dmg file. So we go to Applications, Utilities, DiskUtility.app. We double click on it. And what we're going to do is we're going to go File, New, Blank Disk Image. So this one I'm just going to stick on the desktop. I'm going to call it uh, my disk. Okay. And um, we're going to lay an encryption on it. 128 bit encryption. Single partition read write is fine. I can give it a name here. My disk as well. Then I go. I'm just going to let it be 100 megs. But you could make it anything you want. Believe you can change that later, but even if you couldn't change it later, you could create a new one and then copy the old one. So then you go create, and it's going to ask for a password. I'm just going to make the password dogs d o d o g s d o g s. And I will not remember it in the keychain. I hit OK. And it's going to Go ahead and create the partition. Create the .dmg file. Great. Now we can quit the disk utility. We can go to the finder. We could create a new, we can go to the desktop and look at the file we just created. It'll sort by date modified. And it's going to be called mydisk.dmg. You just double click on it. Actually, it opened it up already over here. Let's, let's get it again. It's going to open it up initially for you because it just created it. Now it should ask for the password. See, it's going to ask for the password. Dogs, D O G S, OK. And then there it is, my disk. So now you're, you're free to copy things to it. And it just, just works like any other disk. And then when you're done, you just eject, eject it. And then there's my disk again there. And now you're, you're free to send it with you send it or whatever. It's just like any other file binary file. Okay, that's it. That's how you can make an encrypted image uh, that you could send over the internet.